everybody. Good morning. I had a request last night to do a charger plate diva. So that's what I'm doing this morning. I have it all. I put the pattern on there. They went black and white. I'm adding a little touch of red. Bring it around it. So I'm starting with this first. Just adding the, the gems and things around. Start with that. Normally I do my decoration at the end. But today I feel like putting it in. Put it on first. See the little red around it? It's going to bring out some of that black. So I'm going to sit up here and put all these gems on here. And then I'm going to figure out this charge plate. I'm kind of late with the charge plate because because y'all in my group already been doing them. So I'm a little late on that one because I've been trying to get other stuff done for y'all. So I'm going to put all these gems on. And then we're going to come back and we're going to put it together. Hopefully it turned out pretty good. Since this is the first charger plate. Right there. So I'll be back. All right. So I got all the gems on my girl already. She's looking cute with her little red and black. Now I'm going to secure. I'm going to use a mirror. I'm going to secure it to to this board but I'm going to use the um, the B7000 along with hot glue to make sure it don't come off because we don't want it falling off once it gets to somebody's house so I'm going to put a nice little layer under here and the hot glue is just to secure it while the B7000 dry For y'all that don't know about the, the B7000 yet, it has a precise tip on it. And then the top has a tip on it as well, where you just push it back in here, and it pushes all the leftover glue back inside. So it's not like that B7000 where it dries up and you're not going to have enough glue. You can't get the rest of the glue out. I'm putting a nice layer around here. B7000 stink just like the other glue. They all stink. But not enough to make you sick, I think. So then I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add some glue to it. Just some glue in certain little spots to hold it down to make sure it don't come off. That's all, like a reinforcement type of thing. That might be enough. All right, so that should hold it, hold it in place while the glue dries along with the um the charger plate. Yep, so that'll help hold it in place. Wipe off all the extra glue down here. That's the wax coming out, the hot glue coming out. So that'll hold it in place, and then it will allow the glue to stick if you decide to use a mirror, because you don't want it to fall down. And then she will go on top of it. Make sure I ain't got no glue or nothing up here. And I noticed that hand sanitizer gets rid of everything. Because <laughs> of the alcohol base, it would get rid of any leftover glue or something that might have fell on there. Even though it's gonna cover it with the girl, you still don't want all that extra stuff on your on your mirror. Get 
rid of all that extra glue. And even though that glue not dry yet, you still it's still sturdy enough that it's not gonna move. It ain't moving, see? <laughs> but it still needs to dry. So she will she will go in there somewhere on top on the side so that you still have some mirror left to look out of. Not sure what I want to put the rest of her on, but she'll get glued down here. I have um, a hat I want to use on the head that I made yesterday, but it has to be trimmed down because it's going to be too big for her and it's charger plate. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can trim this down and figure out what I'm going to do next. can be trimmed because it's just going around in a circle. I think I'm going to take three layers off. Got to get some good scissors first to cut these things because they're hard to cut. Okay, that'll work. Maybe I cut three layers off, which I think three layers might be good. So I'm going to sit up here and cut these three layers off. And then I'm going to take the lighter. Do I have a lighter? And see if I can get rid of some of this SS string that's hanging. It's not hard to take it off. See, it's kind of easy. Once you break, the, break it, it should work. And don't throw those pieces away because you're always going to use those pieces for another time. See, and then I made a smaller hat, <laughs> but I had a lighter around here. It was hard to find stuff. So I got my lighter, and basically, the lighter will be just to just to trim out these edges and seal it up. So you don't want all these raggedy pieces on there. stink so it's just gonna all these strings because there's so much strings in it when you cut it and you don't want all these little stragglies can y'all see them all so because it's plastic it melts very good so I'm just gonna Burn them off and trim them. All right, that's all done. I'm going to use, and yes, I did laminate. It's all laminated. And the gems are on top of the laminated sheets. So that's that's done. So I don't have to worry about that. It's not going to go bad. It's on the mirror. So I'm going to put some B7000 in the back of it. And I'm going to stick it to this glass and to the frame itself. Make sure it don't, it don't come apart. Or, or slide off. So I seen the charger piece that everybody else made in my group. It was very nice. I haven't tried it yet. So this will be my first one. Somebody wanted the charger plate one. I said, all right, that'll work. So I'm going to stick that here on the side because I want to keep some of the mirror left over. So if they're hanging on their wall, they can still see it, the mirror.
now that I cut this hat shorter, and it cute? It can go on here, stick to the top. As long as it got enough room to stick, it's still got a lot of stuff hanging out under here. This will be in the back somewhere. As long as it's still got enough part to stick on there, and then I'll try to um, figure out how I want to. I don't want to make it any shorter than that. So I will have to push it up and try to shape it to whatever way I want as far as having it. So let's put the glue on here. What's left over inside. glue it onto this ball. This high glue is so hot. I don't think it's going to come off, but I'm going to make sure I put enough on there. Ooh, you can feel the heat. And I'm just going to stick that right here on top of her head. Hold it down. Because my hot glue was so hot that it ate up my bowl. So I got a piece of wood here, a um, cake pan. I'm going to cut out a space to put on here. It needs some reinforcement. That's not going to uh, Yeah, depending on what kind of hot glue you're going to use, it's going to eat the whole thing out. So I'm just going to reinforce the hat with this this piece right here. And then that will probably help stir a lot, um, stabilize it to make it stick to the thing. Because it ate up the whole ball inside. That means this thing is extra hot. So I'm going to stabilize it with that. My laminated sheet is plastic, so it's not gonna fall apart. My glue ain't stuck yet. All right, so that seems to be working. It's always a challenge when you're doing something, you know. All right, so that seems to be working fine. And then I can put this on top to create the, uh, the base to hold it down. That part that's messed up, the part that's on the end, we don't want that part to be on top. Now it's flat, it's stabilized. It should be able to stick better now. Then I'll put some decoration on top of this hat. Keep it moving. All right, that look like it's stuck now. So then I got to try to just Fix the hat with the, you know, maybe put, stick a little bit of glue and stick it on there to make this part stick up. Just a little bit in there. And hold it, hold it in place till it dry. And then to make that part of the hat stick up with no problem. Patience, gotta be patient with these things. Yeah, so let me stick a few of them. So I got three done, and I'm gonna do one more and show y'all again. I'm just gonna pinch this up here 
just bring it close enough to here put a little spot of glue in there and then hold it till it dry hold it till it dry and you see the effect that i was going for see how she gonna look she got her her hair is in the weavy thing you got the mirror i'm gonna put something down the bottom and she pretty much gonna be done now you can still look at yourself in this mirror and have a diva on this stuff. So I'm going to hold this a little while longer. Then I'm going to add some embellishments. And I'm going to put something down here on the bottom. And we look like we're all good for right now. I don't think we need nothing else. You can still see her hair wrap and everything under it. I think she's turning out pretty cute. Let me go and figure out what else I want to do. So, I got some bling. I'm going to add all the way around this plate to give you a sexy look. And I might put some on a hat as well. I still got to figure out what I'm going to put down here. It's a, it's a rope chain that I got off of Amazon. So, it's metal. So, my diva on a charger plate with the mirror is almost done. I got to add something down here. I'm about to put some gems on her hat. I already add bling around her edges. Some diamond, diamond ring, diamonds all the way around her edges. So I'm going to put some, put some down here and I should be done. So I got me some, some of these. I'm going to put some of those around it. I will give it a little extra oomph. I'm on the end of my video, I have these rose petals that I got my Dollar Plus store. Um, I don't want them to come off, so I'm going to use some of this, this, and along with some hot glue, just to keep it from falling, coming off. You know, I don't want stuff falling apart. So I'm just going to stick these little. Rose petals on her shirt, making some type of style, and that's the end of it. So make sure y'all like, subscribe to my channel. I hope y'all like my um diva on the charger plate. They already did it in in my group before me, so somebody want one. So since they want one, I might as well do it. Do it and put it on here. So I'm using the hot glue and a little bit E6000. And I'm going to put these petals on her shirt. No, on here as a, as a shirt. To bring some more of the black down the bottom. Since you got that beige uh, or white hat up there. Okay. So that's the end of my video. Hope you like it. So here's my last little bit of touch up that I did. I took the rest of the the mesh, I mean the part of the hat that I took off, I put it around the bottom of the charger plate to give it a, a complete look. I think that's cute. Complete look and then you still got the you got the bling around it. I like it. I think she's cute.